Hello everyone. I hope all of your days are going well. This is going to be a timeless and general reading because I want you to see this and anytime you see this it will be the right time for you. Pardon me. Cards are already falling out of the deck. That was a pentacle. So I'm getting the sense that a lot of people are dealing with money issues or job issues already. I'm going to do a very quick <laughs> general reading. And as I said, this will be timeless. So anytime you see it will be the proper time for you. So the daily spread, I've already shuffled these by the way, but I just kind of wanted you to see me witness me shuffling them again. So the daily tarot spread is a little bit different. It starts out here one, opposite side two, up top three, bottom four, and the outcome is number five, which is in the center. So your number one is um, work, and number two is home, three, unexpected, four is your role, and five is the outcome. So we'll start over here with work. And we have the Eight of Pentacles. That generally means something of academics, uh, studying, maybe you're um, trying to get a promotion or something, and so you're you're working up to make sure that you you know you fit the shoes, I guess, metaphorically speaking. Um, if you're in college, you are you know you have studies, so you're trying to get better at something. Um, which may in turn lead you to having better financial stability. Um, so basically, whatever you're doing, you're on the right track here with studying and getting to know your your subject. So that's a good sign for work. You never don't want to have like five of wands or something like, oh, everybody's fighting. So here you're doing what you're supposed to be doing. You're studying is how I see this eight of pentacles. Hopefully you can see that. <laughs> So for number two, we have home, eight of cups, perhaps you've been dealing with some emotional baggage, maybe someone has passed on and you know, when you go home, you're, you kind of just sit and think about these types of things. Um, maybe you were giving yourself, giving time to someone in your life and it's about time for you to walk away or maybe you did just walk away. Um, if you're in a marriage, you may be thinking, this is the end of the road, I can't deal with this person anymore, or any relationship, not just marriage. Um, something, you're emotional, you just run out, you've run out of anything to give, you're just ready to walk away from some situation. Um, yeah, so I'm seeing maybe that's what this pinnacle is, you're working harder at work, um, Focusing more on work because your home life is kind of like, eh. <sighs> so this is Eight of Cups. It's emotional, kind of like unfulfilled here. So you're walking away from something that's not serving you and you're putting your attention in your work or your schooling. That's how I'm seeing it right now. Three, the unexpected King of Cups. Ooh, King of Cups. So... I don't always like to just say things like, oh, this is a relationship, this is a, a partner, a man or a woman coming in to save you, you know, um, King of Cups is, well, Cups are emotions, so probably you're going to reach the, the top with this, um, you're going to get through it. I mean, right now, that's what happens with anyone who's dealing with an emotional situation. They kind of just like, oh my gosh, I'll never get through this. I'm just depressed, I'm worn down, and in the end, I mean, something's going to happen and it's going to help to uplift you. And it might be the result of your work here. So, that's good. That's what we've got here. I'm not sure if I showed you that already. <laughs> but yeah, that's King of Cups, so that would be unexpected. And King of Cups is a representation. Um, let me just make sure that I've got this good here. Do, 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 do. Yeah, someone uh, creative in the professional environment and someone warm loving. So, you know, your time is going to come where you are definitely healed. 
But number four, your role in this is nine of pentacles. It's like if you've earned, you know, something in your life, you've got your money, you have cleaned your house, whatever that you've accomplished here with nine of pentacles, um, you can, you can kind of just like, hmm, what is the word that I'm looking for? Um, it's kind of like reap what you sow, reap in the benefits. I guess reap is the proper term. Anyway, so yeah, you're you're enjoying what you've built. You know what I mean? You're kind of just like, oh, all right, this is what I have. Basically, take a moment to be grateful for everything that you have. Um, you're never going to be done working, but you definitely, you've got it pretty good right now. Um, we all go through emotional things and... Yeah, it's financial success and material security. Security. So this is all actually looking like, you know, it makes sense. It's coming together. What is the outcome for number five? It is the six of cups, which can represent nostalgia, you know, just going back to old times when you were your happiest self and you did things that make you happy, you know, um, whether you used to say you like learning languages when you were a kid or you like to sew um, or maybe call up some old friends to help you get through your emotional thing that you got here um but the outcome is looking really good it's looking like you really actually you know where you're supposed to go you know a lot of times people are like i don't know what i need to focus on well you need to focus on your work according to eight of pentacles because that is important so if you are studying or you're trying to get a promotion um, or you're just, you know, being really going hard at your job, this Eight of Pentacles is definitely for you. All you can really do at the end of the day is focus on your studies. Um, with Eight of Cups, walking away from something that is not emotionally fulfilling, that is always smart, and you will come out as a King of Cups. So, that looks pretty good. This is a really decent reading, guys. I think that... I think you guys know what you're supposed to do, and if you did not know what you were supposed to do and focus on, it's... It's here, you know, focus on your work, focus on your job or your, your, uh, schooling. Um, I know it's hard, heartbreak is tough, um, but you just can't quit, you know, just sitting in the dark all day, they're not going to pay the bills. And to focus, keep yourself busy, that usually helps you get out of things. It helps you get through things. I won't say get out of them, you do have to go through the process, but you will be victorious in this King of Cups. Nine of Pentacles, you're, what you're studying, you know, doing your job there, you're helping yourself to boost your finances or, you know, your stability in general. And then Six of Cups, once you feel, you know, emotionally, um, this, that emotional baggage is gone and you realize that you're doing well in your work environment, then you will start to feel better about yourself and lead to feeling like that happy child, you know, that you know, if you're blessed to have a, a decent childhood. Um, and even if not, you know, there's always something, some good memories you can take away from that. Um, but yeah, so this looks pretty good. And I hope to all see you another time and do another reading for you. Thank you so much. Take care.